Hi, I'm Megan, and this is my story about how I impacted my fertility benefits at my workplace. In the last four years, I found out I had PCOS, and then we moved on to a fertility clinic, which we did five IUIs, and now we'll be moving on to IVF. I work at a call center where I handle sometimes difficult situations. My fertility journey has impacted me at work and has made it hard for me to stay calm in those situations. I was looking for support on Facebook and came across the Fertility Matters page on Facebook. Um, and I noticed that they had posts about employer fertility benefits, which got me thinking at my work, we, we did have already fertility benefits, but I was getting to the max point and it made me think that I really wanted to say something about improvement. On Bell Let's Talk Day of 2021, the president of the company sent out a mass email welcoming anyone to come forward with any feedback, suggestions, or whatnot. And um, because I had seen those posts about fertility benefits, that's when I decided to write him an email. And I included the template that the fertility benefits page had, which was really helpful for me. And in my email, I didn't just discuss my personal situation. I kind of brought it you know, to light about same-sex couples um, who need access and those who didn't have access already within our company. I did get a reply from the president of the company and he put me in touch with the head of benefits where we had a Zoom meeting um, and I was able to talk about my experience so far with infertility and treatments. It can be a long and expensive process and sometimes your, your ben benefits are kind of getting maxed out in the early stages or even the middle stages. So during the Zoom meeting, they actually told me they were going to immediately change the drug coverage across all banners because at that point, not all banners of the company were having the same benefits. Um, so they made that change immediately. And then over time, they ended up changing the drug coverage to not just for drug coverage, but also fertility treatment. I'm really glad that I spoke up because I don't know if there would have been any change to the fertility benefits. So I do encourage others to do so um, to make change. I'm really thankful for my employer in making that change and to Fertility Matters for providing me that template because it really made the process a lot smoother. I know it can be scary to bring this up to your employer, but I mean, I'm nobody special and I was able to, so you can too.